use as a RPA on the WOG machine. So first thing is you, you need to get a software that you are whitelisted. Uh, the IT department already has all the files and the process of being getting it whitelisted on your WOG should be rather straightforward now because I've taken the time to do it all. So first thing to do is you need to type tech UI and then followed by the file name. Then you press enter and then it will launch tech UI's own browser. And let me try to bring that up. Uh, this own browser. Okay. So it will try to log into SLS by keying in the password. Uh, sorry, the username, and then followed by you will tap to the next field and then you will type in the password and then you'll click log in. So all this is all done automatically uh, if you write the script on Tech UI. Uh, so now the computer is now going to my verification email, alternate email to get the OTP. You will extract the OTP. So if you are doing this, I recommend you use uh, Google Gmail to be your alternate email for SLS because uh, the, the script is already there. So you probably just need to change the URL and it will work for you as well. Because if you try to use another email, it, it will be harder uh, to replicate the success that uh, has been done in the code. So it will try to detect whether there's a pop up. Then if there is, it will try to click away the escape. And then it will, OK, it's probably taking some time. So it will crawl through line by line uh, all the activities on the da table data. And then it will populate in a CSV later. And then now it's just now it was going to get the URL from the lesson by clicking on the open. So typically if you do this, uh, you can get the, the data nicely done on, uh, on the computer, but using Tech UI and some JavaScript know-how, uh, you can actually do all this rather uh, easier. I mean, you can, compared to UiPath, I think, the tech UI is, is probably a bit simpler because UI path, the interface is uh, a little bit more complex. Uh. Whereas in tech UI, you're just writing lines of codes. Uh. I mean, it's naturally language. Uh. So you have to click away this one. Uh, if you don't, then you will probably be unable to crawl out the, the URL correctly. But it's a small problem. So not yet finished. Uh, the crawling and you can see that uh, it has completed the extraction 